Welcome back, Friday on Squawk Asia. Two and a half years since the Fukushima disaster, looks like Japan could be ready to restart some of its 50 nuclear reactors. But on the ground, though, sentiment is still strongly opposed to the restarting of nuclear power. CNBC's Sri Jagaraja recently traveled to the area and files this report. Opponents of nuclear energy don't come tougher than Fukushima cattle farmer Masami Yoshizawa. I am cowboy and resistance. Fueled by coffee, cigarettes and love for his herd of Wagyu cattle, this 59-year-old rancher, like many hit by the 2011 triple disaster, wants Tokyo to pull the plug on atomic power. We clearly know what will happen if there's another earthquake and another tsunami. We need to end nuclear power plants in Japan and I think people have learned that. The meltdown at TEPCO's Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant, triggered by the earthquake and tsunami of March 2011, cost him his livelihood, his once prized stock rendered worthless after being contaminated by radiation through water and pastures. Yet he and farmers like him continue to defy government orders to cull these animals, relying on donations to keep the cows at Kibo no Bokujo, Ranch of Hope, fed and sheltered. Cow terrorism, as Yoshizawa calls it, is his way of directing public opinion against the Abe administration's plan to switch some reactors back on. In the heydays, Yoshizawa would earn as much as $14,000 from a single Wagyu cow at market. But it was a cash cow of an entirely different variety that led to Fukushima's problems. It was old, so the people uh, and TEPCO knew very well there's a risk because of if tsunami may happen, there could be catastrophe. But actually it is old, but it is a uh, cash cow. If it is run, it is almost depleted. So while they are operating it, it uh, creates more cash. Japan's government admits mistakes were made, but led to expensive and important lessons learned. So over all else, safety is paramount. Our belief is that for the reactors which are deemed safe, we will restart them. The rebel farmers and the cows they protect face an uncertain future. But one thing is clear, nuclear power is unwelcome. The Abe administration, riding high in the opinion polls, faces one of its biggest tests yet in convincing a fearful and resentful public as it considers the switch back to nuclear power. Sri Jagaraja, CNBC.